Okay. Let's see how we did today. Was that Cedar Chase golf course? I remember this course. Jot my name down there. Played the blue tees. Uh, April 20th, last year. Hot, sunny. 1 p.m. start. Light breeze. Okay, first of all, let's see, I had my par. Got a greenie. Two putts. I hit the fairway. There you go. Get the score. Fairway, F in the corner, a little dot. Tells you hit the green, and there's a two for two pots. And then you do that again. <clears throat> oh, we got a bogey this time. Missed the green. Got the fairway. Three putts. Nine, I got the fairway. Got the greenie. Two putts. Par. Okay. So that's kind of what they look like as you go across there. Then you can quickly add these up. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty-four, eighteen putts. Four, five, six, seven. Eight greens in regulation. Two, three, four, five fairways. Eight greenies. Nine, ten, eleven, twenty, twenty, thirty-six. And it's as simple as that. One birdie on the card there with a circle on it. It really doesn't take hardly any time at all, more than uh, when you're normally just keeping score. Well, there you have it. That's one quick way to uh, add up your scorecard a little bit differently. And what that brutally tells you is if you hit eight, fair, eight greens in regulation and had 18 putts, I got a serious problem with my putting. So that's where I would look forward to uh, look for some improvements in the game. And you can see a few other stats go on the story about what the stat really kind of tells you. So it's worth keeping track of it, and I hope you pick up this new technique to start your season out this year.